Sometimes your meta conversion API events will have some very awkward data. You will see a huge number of conversion API events compared to browser events. This happens because a crawler, a boot, is going through your website links, firing some conversion API events. I've seen this happen. I've seen this problem with uh, WooCommerce websites using unusual add to cart buttons. Uh, some themes have um, Ajax buttons that can be fired by crawlers. Uh, so it's not a general problem. M most likely you don't have it. But if you see a very uh, large discrepancy between add to cart browser events and add to cart conversion API events, this is the most likely cause. Uh, and uh, your data will look something like this. You will uh, check your add to cart data and you will see, I don't know, uh, 20 browser events and 20,000 conversion API events. And this is obviously not right. The solution that we have, it's pretty simple. Uh, if you use Pixel your site, professional or free, you can scroll and look for this option. Disable known web crawlers. Enable this uh, feature option and save. Maybe it's not enough. Maybe there is a crawl that we don't know about. And to fix such a problem, you can add the crawler IP in this field right here. Uh, you need to enable this different feature, disable the plugin for these IP addresses and add the IP address of the crawler. Now, crawler. now how can you find out the IP address? It's a very simple procedure. On the plugin uh, logs page, linked right here, uh, you can enable plugin logs. When you do this, the plugin will start to record uh, data about conversion API events. So wait for some time until this crawler uh, revisits your website. I'm trying to fire some conversion API events just to show you how the log will look like. So once this crawler uh, visits your website, look for repeated um, a large number of IP addresses related to add to cart events and Right here, you can see the client IP address. This is my current IP address. Uh, copy, so you need to identify the IP address uh, firing all these um, extraordinary events, not any IP address. But this log will help you to do it. Identify the IP, go back to the plugin, enable this feature and add the IP right here and save. Now, uh, make sure you disable the logs once you identify this IP address because otherwise the size of the log file will be huge. So disable, save. You can also clear the logs if you want. Uh, you can also download the logs if you need to. So I will just clear the logs. Thank you for watching. I'm Christian Stoichescu from Pixel Your Site. Like, share this video and subscribe to our channel. It's very important and it will help me to become finally a YouTube celebrity. That's my secret dream, of course, and only you can help me achieve such a crazy dream. Subscribe.